Hello, my name is Amy Ecker. Welcome to my channel. So today I'm doing an all-day wear test on the Stay Naked Weightless Liquid Foundation up to 24 hours. And this is from Urban Decay. This is in one standard fluid ounce. It's a plastic bottle, although it doesn't look like it, which is kind of bougie on a budget. Um, I got the color 41NN. It's a light medium shade intensity. It has a neutral undertone and the writing so close to the color of the box I can't tell the rest okay there we go so what do I think initially about this foundation so the foundation I think is a medium light to medium coverage I think that's the best way to describe it I could still see some of my freckling or cheetah spots after I put on the foundation I did not build it up. I just wanted to see what, I think I used three pumps for the face and then one around my neck so I could get kind of a uniform color. And yeah, I just didn't, I wanted to see what my normal coverage would be like for an all day wear test. The makeup, the rest of the makeup did set up nice. I used some Makeup Geek for the cheeks and highlighter and contour. I used, what did I use? I used the Wonder 2 Perfect Selfie for underneath the eyes. And I used some L'Oreal Infallible um, as my highlighter. And then as the setting spray, I actually used the Bosch, Bosha. Uh, white charcoal mattifying makeup setting spray. I put that on first and after so we're gonna see how these all do Now as far as my first impression goes once I got kind of the highlight and contour in the areas um, I think that kind of brought down some of the freckling however, I can still see some of my age spots through it but overall, it's not bad. It's just not one one coat that sounds like I'm painting a car so my initial coat like I normally would wear with a heavier foundation yeah you can still see some spots through it does that stop me from wanting to try it nah because if this is really up to 24 hour coverage I'd really like to see it work up to 24 hours actually I don't have my makeup on that long so I'd really like to just see it work through a work day and that's what we're gonna do today we're gonna put it through just an average maybe eight or nine hour work day and see how it does so if you'd like to know how this performs you're in the right spot so stay tuned okay y'all this is the end of a work day. I did blow my nose um, today and the foundation kind of held up. Kind of surprised, kind of surprised. So overall, I like the performance of this foundation. I don't have a lot of breaking up on my skin. I did rub it off at the tip where I did blow my nose. But overall, everywhere else other than the tip, kind of held up good. So let's try to blot this for the first time because I did not blot today. And we'll see how this looks if that takes down some of the shine. And it was warm today in Texas, which I just got back from Wyoming. And it snowed in Wyoming at my brother's house and sister-in-law's house here. I'm in t-shirts and a short shorts go figure okay you can see I have lots of oils pulling coming through I did use five blotting papers to pull off that extra oil overall it doesn't look like it pulled too much of the color there are some spots that it did pull a little bit of color off but let's take a closer look Overall, I'm really impressed with how this did not break up. Like I said, as far as my nose goes, that really, had I not had to blow my nose today, yummy, um, I really think that my nose would have been just fine. But I, I like how this foundation's held up. 
The only thing that I would say that I would love for it to change about this foundation is that it's not full coverage. For light coverage ladies or medium coverage ladies, I think this would be great for you. For me, I like a, or not just that I like, but I need a thicker foundation to hide all my, my cheetah spots and my freckles and everything else I have going on. Tomorrow, I, I am going to try to build it up since today I did not just to see if that kind of helps a little bit cover the cheetah spots because really and truthfully the fact that it didn't break up on me and it was kind of warm today I'm pretty dang impressed I'm pretty impressed so I'm curious has anyone else tried the stay naked weightless liquid foundation up to 24 hour wear if you did I'm really curious to see what your opinion is also would like to know do you have oily, dry combo skin?